Powell, former U.S. intelligence officer Malcolm Nance. He's now the... Which brings us to Malcolm Nance. Uh... You said something earlier about uh, one of the strategies that employed suicide bombers. If you could, if you could make the 70-year-old couple in Waldorf, Maryland, that's watching this show right now, mm -hmm. understand what it is about an individual that would take them from being a living, breathing, functioning person in society, however, whatever form of society that is, mm -hmm. and have them to strap on bombs and go kill themselves. It's, it's fascinating, isn't it? The best way to put this is that we all understand religion. We all understand that religion, whether it's Christianity, Judaism, Islam, gives you faith and gives you something to anchor yourself with. Mm -hmm. And we understand within our religions, the Abrahamic traditions, the three religions of the Abrahamic tradition, right? Islam, Judaism, Christianity, mm -hmm. all right? That worship of God and giving God his due is the heart of that. Mm -hmm. And of course, even in all three, living a good life and a godly life mm -hmm. is what most people want. Mm -hmm. ISIS and Al Qaeda's ideology, which is where ISIS drew its ideology, Osama bin Laden's, they have an entirely different belief system. They believe that traditional Islam, as it existed since the year 632, since 1,439 years, is completely wrong. That the problem with Islam is tolerance. Huh. That the problem with Islam is respect for Christians and Jews. Huh. And that in fact, Islam should have never changed between 632 and 644. Mm -hmm. That's when the lifespans of the immediate friends of the companions of the Prophet Muhammad, his immediate friends, mm -hmm. the people that they call the best of all Muslims, mm -hmm. and that w they have to live. Anyone who wants to be a Muslim like them, beyond ultra-Orthodox, you have to live your life like those people at that time, the way they lived, literally. It would be like a Christian coming and saying, we're going to abandon everything that we know right now, we're going to live exactly the way that the, the 12 Judeans who were with Jesus Christ of Nazareth mm -hmm. lived. Mm -hmm. Dress, mm -hmm. diet, mm -hmm. belief system, mm -hmm. only we're gonna do it with automatic weapons and anyone that doesn't adhere to our ideology, mm -hmm. we kill. Mm -hmm. Now, that would override everything Jesus Christ lived for, right? Mm -hmm. Same with the prophet Muhammad. Right. ISIS is a cult. Mm -hmm. They're very close to the first Islamic cult, a group called the Khawarij mm -hmm. uh, that existed in 644. That group was nine men they split Islam into Sunnah and Shia just yeah. through an assassination. Yeah. So what would make them put on that vest? Mm -hmm. The cultist interpretation. What is their <coughs> short-term strategy mm -hmm. to grow? And what is the U.S. and world's, what should the U.S. and world's strategy be to stop them from growing? That's a good question. Oh, my.